Vulture sat moping on the fence wire one day when Chicken Hawk flew down next to him. What's the matter with you, cousin? You're looking kind of peaked. I'm hungry. I haven't eaten for three days. You haven't eaten for three days? I can't believe it. Why, look all around here. There's grouse, there's quail, there's rabbits, there's little bitty birdies. Can't eat that stuff. Dead, dead. It's gotta be dead. If it puts up a fight, I lose my appetite. Dead, dead. It's gotta be dead. Yes, if it stinks, not if it blinks. Dead. You haven't eaten for a three? I can't believe it. Why, if you're feeling puny, there's a farmhouse down there with a hen with chicks. You can swoop down and grab one. Swoop down and grab another. Fresh chicken meat. Yum! Yuck! I can't eat that stuff. Dead, dead. It's gotta be dead. If it puts up a fight, I lose my appetite. Dead, dead. It's gotta be dead. Yes, if it stinks. Not if it blinks. Dead. I know what's wrong with you. It's your hunting technique. You just need some lessons from the master. See that squirrel over there by the fence post? Watch me, oh student, and learn. Chicken Hawk flew way up in the air. He circled once. He circled twice. And then he headed straight for the ground. Just when it looked like he was going to hit the ground, he straightened out and headed for the squirrel at the fence post. But just before he got there, he looked over his shoulder to see if the vulture was watching, and smack! He ran right into the fence post. Thank goodness. I knew if I waited long enough, something would die. Dead, dead, it's gotta be dead. If it puts up a fight, I lose my appetite. Dead, dead, it's gotta be dead. Yes, if it stinks, not if it blinks, dead.